Hey guys, today this video is going to show you how to make Lucky Charm braces. You can use this design to make it just like a charm, the poly cover. And then for decoration, just like this. Or you can make it into braces like this. So up to you. For this braces, I use single bands throughout the project and it looks like this for this one I use double bands double band looks more solid and but also more more um, looks bulkier than just single band you can try it out and it really just personal preference depend on what you want to use for for braces I choose to use just single bands right here and it looks like this but if I want to make a key change I would use double pen I think it will work better and looks better and I will leave that up to you to decide for this project we're gonna set our room straight eye up on the bottom and keep your red yellows pointing away from you first we're gonna make a leaf like this we take one single pen Start it from the center, first to second, and second to third. Now we take single bands from center to second on your left, and second to third. And do one more time. Stop right here, and now we go from center to your left. Now we come back here, start it from the first on the center, go now on second on your right. And go up one time, two times. And then going from third on the center, going up to your right, right here. And this is what it should look like. I use all single band for this project. Now we're gonna keep our bands down and we're gonna press horizontal band, one single band. For the first one, we wanna bring in this one inside here. And this horizontal band should look like this. And then we take one single band and twist one time you will see two rings on your hook and then press it here as horizontal band through here and then we take one single band twist two times you will see three rings here and then press here last one on your left and we're gonna make another cap band press it right here on your right <coughs> take one single band, twist two times, you will see three rings here, and then press it here, last one on your right. And this is what it should look like. Now we're going to rotate our room and we start looping. We reach under the cap band, grab the first one. Hold on to your cap band and then you will see the teardrops forming and then you hook it back to the center here from here to here. Now I'm gonna come back here, reach in, grab the bottom one, and then hook it to the next one. And stay inside horizontal band and then grab the bottom one, hook it to the next one. And the same, stay inside horizontal band and teardrop. Grab the bottom one. This time we're gonna hook it back to the center from here to here. Now we're gonna come back here and the same. Grab the first one on the cap band and then hook it to the center. Make sure it's the same one. You will see teardrops one on the top and one on the bottom and then 
come back here grab the bottom one hook it to the next one here from here to here and then stay inside horizontal bank grab the bottom one hook it to the next one here and then last one grab the last one and hook it back to the center from here to here now we're going to come back here the same grab the bottom one hook it to the next one grab the bottom one hook it to the next one and we're done loop painting now we take one single band reach inside all the bands and grab it through here and then you hook the other end here on both ends and you just grab one end through the others and pull it that will secure the whole thing here and now it's time to take it out I like to use my hook to help it take it out so we won't pull too much especially for the smaller project that way we don't have to fix it until we pull it out too much and after you pull it out you fix it a little bit so you won't look messy and this rubber band is flexible so you can you can kind of make it to look the way you want it then this is one of the lid we're gonna need four of them so pass your video and make three more times so total we're gonna need four of them one two three four to make our lucky charm we're gonna connect these four leaves together and make it look like a charm here and in this project I'm gonna turn it into braces for the braces I use for the braces for this one I use just single very simple single to connect them together it depends on the size that you need I use I need 20 of the bands here to make my size so you can adjust to the size that will fit you better and then so we're just gonna do the single here again single here you need to keep your red arrows point away from you and because my size I need 20 so I use 10 on each side 10 on this side and 10 on this side so I'm gonna make 10 first 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 eight nine ten now we're gonna repeat this step and make another ten single to fit on the other side this time I'm gonna start from third pins on your right one two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The reason why I start on second one, third one is because I need ten of them, and we're gonna connect all these charms at this point. So this one, since it's the last one, will be easier to work on it. But you don't have to do this. I just thought this would be easier to do. But if you need shorter, then you can do the same thing. Just cut up some of the band here and here, and it will turn out the same. And now I'm gonna take one single band, twist only one time. You will see two rings here, and then press on the last one here, right here. And this is what it should look like. Now we rotate our room. This is just that like simple single presses you can do it without loom on this part no problem but i'm just gonna go ahead and do it this way and 
and many of you probably already know how to do this part you can skip this part this is to show just in case you're not sure what to do and then after you finish this you take this part out carefully take out your hook and press aside now for this part we're gonna connect this lid right here for because we want to make it the braces the chains on both sides so we need to put two leaves in first and then so we take one and we release the secure pin the last one make sure you hold on to here so you won't get loose here and you put your hook back into the loose end the secure pin and you press it right here in the last one right here and then we're going to take another leaf and then the same press it right here now we want to press this chain for the other side make sure you put two and put the chain first and then put another leaf on the other side if you don't do that then it won't stay two in this side and two in this side so make sure you only do two first and then press this chain that we make and then press right here and now we're gonna press the other two leaves on here again the same hold on to the last one here and then put your hook back to the loose end the secure pin that we had tied and tied that we just untied and then press it right here and now this is last leaf untie the secure pin and then put your hook back into both end here and then press it right here make sure you grab both end and there's so many pin here so make sure you push in so you will stay in now we're gonna go inside here through all the bands and find this pin the last one it should be last one and then grab this last band put your hook to all of the bands so many bands here so make sure you grab the right one this should be the last one and then carefully hold on to all the band here and grab it after you grab it you should see a little teardrop here that means you grab the right one if you didn't see these teardrops forming that means you grab one of these bands then you won't work it's very important here that you grab the right band this this is the important band that connect all the pieces together so if you grab one of these bands in here then after you pull it out you're falling apart so make sure you see two teardrops here one in the bottom and one on the top and then we just continue to loop in the band grab the bottom one hook it to the next one and just do like a single and continue to do this for all of them now we take one C clip and clip through here and then it's time to pull it up here's so many pen here so we can use the hook to pull it up now you have your lucky charm braces 
Now you can take this C clip and the other end should be a cap band and then you can just clip in here and here is your lucky charm braces. I hope we bring you some luck. Good luck! Thank you for watching. See you next time.